Hi, I'm Ross Waters, President of CGIS. Today we're going to examine Valve Technologies flagship valve, the V1 metal seated valve. Now we're going to examine what makes this valve actually work and that's the integral seat. This piece that I'm holding is one of the two body halves, asymmetrically made. It holds the primary sealing function of this valve, the integral seat, part of the end cap as I said, which is mate lapped to the ball, both of which are coated with extreme hard material, chrome or tungsten carbide. The two pieces are then lapped together to form a perfect pair. And once that pair is loaded with the bell bullet at the other end, then it's tight enough to stop any kind of gas from going through, including helium or hydrogen. This is a true zero leakage valve, does not have a leak rate, FCI 70.2, class five or class six in our opinion are failures when it comes to isolating high pressure energy systems like steam or feed water. Any leakage is gonna damage because it's gonna be erosive. So this is the innovation that Kevin Hunt formulated his company in 1984, the first true integral seated ball valve. Another very important part of the whole valve is how the hard coating is applied. Hunt's idea in 1984 of having an integral seat valve design for a ball valve, which was unique, would still not have been possible unless we had a technique of applying extreme hard coatings to the ball and the end cap. This was high velocity oxygen fuel or HVOF um, and using chrome or tungsten carbide as the coating material. The kinetic transfer of energy on that rocket applied engine was such that it would penetrate the, pa the parent material, in this case carbon steel, or in this case 316 stainless steel, and make a skin. If you look at this ball carefully, you can see that this part is dull, this part is shiny. The difference is the shiny part is being lapped with diamond paste onto the, mate, to the integral seat. There's still a coating, a hard coating on this side, but because of the direction of isolation, we don't need to polish this with the valve unless it's a bi-directional application. The hard coating make this valve very successful on steam, feed water, high pressure, or high energy systems because it's very resistant to uh, hardness change, even at temperature. At over 1,000 degrees Fahrenheit, it still retains its hardness above Rockwell C60. If you compare that with the industry standard Stellite, Stellite becomes under 26 at 1,000. At 1,400, it's so soft, it's like butter and can merge into itself or cold weld. Even at 1,000, this is always going to be above Rockwell C60, so we don't have any issues with cold welding or um, destruction of the, of the coating. Now we're going to look at the body joint gasket. When you're selling or providing a high performance isolation valve that is zero leakage. You also don't want any leakage from the body joint or the stem. In, in the valve uh, technologies V1 series, they use a metal gasket that's trapped inside a slot in one of the body halves and then compressed by the body bolts. This exerts a force of over 20,000 PSI and ensures a very, very tight seal into this gasket, which is made of either 17,4 pH or in canals at higher temperature. They're graphite loaded and th valves three inch and bigger have a secondary graphite seal as well. The next part that makes the valve extremely good in any high energy situation is the live loading of the gland. Even in the smallest valve, this 3 8 bore, it has four bolt minimum gland. Each of the bolts li are live loaded with belva washers, which are exerting a spring force to compensate for any thermal swings between the process temperature inside the pipe and ambient temperature wherever the valve is located inside, outside, it doesn't matter. The differences can be immense. You can have minus 50 degrees in Fort McMurray in outside and 700 degrees inside. And the bellvils will do all the compensation for that uh, change in the, in the uh, material growth or shrinkage in temperature. So that's a look at the Valve Technologies V1 Series Severe Service Metal Seated Integral Seat Supported Design that's capable of the tightest isolation that's possible. It's so good, in fact, that on any power application, steam or feed water, we offer a four-year guarantee against leakage. That's not a free of manufacturing defects warranty. It's a guarantee that this valve, when you put it on, um, an isolating opportunity like a vent or a drain will give you that guarantee of four years before you ever have to think about replacing it. It is the finest example of an isolation valve that we can think of in the world.